Dear students, this is the last question from exercise 13.3. A farmer connects a pipe of Indiana diameter 20 cm from a canal into a cylindrical tank in her field, which is 10 m in diameter and 2 m deep. If water flows through the pipe at the rate of 3 km per hour, in how much time will the tank be filled? Let's assume the tank will get filled in 3 hours. This is the cylindrical tank situated in the field. The diameter of the tank is 10 meter, so the radius of the tank is 5 meter. Its height is 2 meter. A cylindrical pipe is connected from a canal into the tank to fill the water. So here is the canal and from this canal the cylindrical pipe is connected into the tank. The speed of water that flows through the pipe is given as 3 km per hour. That means the water reaches up to a length of 3 km through the pipe in 1 hour. This is the cross section of the pipe connected into the tank. The length of this cross section is 3 km which is equal to 3000 meter. The internal diameter of the pipe is 20 cm, so the internal radius of the pipe is 10 cm. Converting into meter, we get 0 0.1 meter. The length of the pipe is 3000 meter. Let's take the radius of the tank and height of the tank as capital R and H respectively. And the internal radius and length of the pipe are small r and small h respectively. Now the volume of the cross section is pi r square h. And the volume of the tag is pi capital R square capital H. This cross section will get filled in one hour. That means an amount of water equal to the volume of this cross section will fall into the tank in one hour. The volume of water that flows into the tank in T hours is equal to the volume of the tank. Volume of the water that flows into the tank in T hours is pi r square h into T. And the volume of the tank is pi capital R square capital H. Cancel pi from both sides. Now radius of the cross section is 0 0.1. So 0 0.1 square. And the length of the cross section is 3000 meter. So H is 3000 meter. Into T is equal to. Radius of the tank is 5 meter, so 5 square into height of the tank is 2 meter. So 1 by 10 into 1 by 10 into 3000 into T is equal to 5 into 5, 25 into 2, 50. Cancel these terms by 3000. So we get 30 T is equal to 50. T is equal to 50 divided by 30. Cancel the zeros. So the time taken to fill the tank is 5 by 3 hours, which is equal to 100 minutes. 
Hope that this explanation was clear. If you have any doubts, please share them in the comment box. Thank you.